hi welcome back to my channel i'm mangesh and uh, in this video we will learn which are the apps or which are the tools you can install on your uh, windows machine for unix command practice so there are multiple tools uh, in the market you can google it and uh, you can install on your windows machine and you can do the practice of uh, unix commands uh, in this laptop uh, we will see how to install ubuntu application on windows 10 machine uh, then I'll also show you what is a Sigwin and Termux. Termux uh, is an application. It's a mobile based application under uh, Android. Uh, you can go to the Play Store where you will find out Termux. And that application also you can use for the Unix command practice. But it's a mobile view. And these two you can install on your Windows machine for your Unix command practice. First of all, we will see how to install Ubuntu application on this. Uh, I am using Windows 10 laptop here. You can see the configuration. You must require Windows 10 plus uh, uh, you require 4 GB RAM at least. Okay, so 4 GB RAM, Windows 10 machine, Windows 10 professional is here, but Windows 10 single user pack is also okay for this operation. So now see the steps what we need to do first. Uh, go to your start button and type features features you can see there is a one option turn off turn windows features on or off i'm clicking on it so this dialog box is opening windows features under it we have an option called as uh, windows subsystem for linux look at this i have highlighted this and i i already checked it so if this option is disabled, you need to make it enable. After enabling these options, it will apply uh, some features on your laptop or on your desktop. It takes only few seconds. And after uh, feature is updated, then uh, it will it it will ask for the reboot, and you need to reboot your laptop. Once your laptop is rebooted, then you need to log in into your Microsoft Store. So I already uh, enabled this, and uh, my laptop is just rebooted. So let me go to the my Microsoft stores. You can see Microsoft store is here. So we need to log in into it because I need to download Ubuntu application. So it's Microsoft Microsoft store is the same like your Play Store in Android. Here you'll get some applications also. So let me log in into it signing in and guys you required only outlook email id to log in into it you can try with gmail also but i have my outlook email id also so i'm using the same for the login purpose now successfully login into it it will take time now I have logged into my Microsoft Store and uh, I required Ubuntu app. So Ubuntu is applications where you can do the Linux commands practice. There are multiple versions are here. Uh, I'll take the old one 18.01. See version can be anything. If you are aware of all Linux commands, you can use any applications. So I'm taking the previous one 18.01 and I'm uh, downloading the same one it is taking time actually okay so at the last download option you, you can click on install button directly it will automatically download and install on this laptop now downloading is started and uh, uh, it will take some time to download and install on this laptop Meanwhile, uh, we can see how to uh, install the Sigwin application also. So downloading is started for Ubuntu one. Then uh, let's jump to the Sigwin. For Sigwin, uh, see, few of the laptops. Sigwin is supportable in Windows 7, Windows 8, Windows 10, everywhere. Go to the Google and just type Sigwin for Windows 10. Sigwin is also same where you can do the Unix commands or Linux command practice. Uh, here I have the option 
install sigwin setup i can see here i am taking 64 bit because my laptop is a 64 bit and that setup i have downloaded so just click on it and install it i am executing this setup so it will download the package from that website and uh, it will automatically install on this laptop so it takes time to installation it will take ar around 5 10 minutes it will take 5 to 10 minutes to install on this laptop so sigwin setup is started and um, I'm doing next, next. Let's see the set setup. Uh, I guess Ubuntu app is also downloaded here. See, my Ubuntu application is already downloaded. So I have opened that app in my laptop. It is still installing and it will take few minutes and it is available under my start button you can click here I can see my Ubuntu app is here Ubuntu 18.04 I will just type Ubuntu then I can see here I can launch that setup on my desktop also Open. So this is already installed. Once it's done, uh, we will add our user ID into it. So through that user ID, we can access this Ubuntu app and we can use Unix command for practice purpose here. It's still taking time and uh, my Sigwin is also downloading. So this board terminal we can use for the Unix command practice. For few laptops, uh, this will work, and Segwin will work in all the laptops. The view user interface view is different, but output of each and every commands would be the same. So we'll wait for two minutes more, and uh, then we'll see what happens with this installation. And I can show you one more uh, example: Termux. Uh, Termux is a mobile view. So let me see. Max. Go to the images and we can see here. So this is what the Termux view. Like uh, in your Android phone, you need to just install Termux application where you can use commands directly over there. So these are the application already designed for Unix command practice. We just need to install it and we need to use it. My Sigwin is installed successfully. Uh, I can see Sigwin terminal is there on my desktop. I'm just opening it. Okay. So full screen I have done. See, now I'm entering date command. It will print today's date and time. At the output, I'm entering cal command. Cal command will print current month calendar. Look at this, it is. So my Unix commands are started working here. PWD, my home directory is this. These are the Unix command I'm using. So this is one uh, terminal where you can do the Unix command practice. You can increase the font size also. You can go to the option button. Here you'll get a chance to increase the font size. Let me make it 10, apply, and I have saved it. So in this way, you can install Sigwin app on your desktop and you can use for the practice purpose. Now, these are the my Unix commands which I'm hitting and I'm getting the output. So I will start adding some few basic Unix commands videos, practicals uh, in my channel also.
in this video we will just cover up the installation part now let's see what is the status of uh, ubuntu app yeah it is asking for the username so i'll give my username as a mangesh uh, you can set password for this so i have entered password as well and now my I'm able to log into my app also. Look at the output now. Cal command output, PWD command output, date command output. The view, uh, view is a little bit different and uh, I'm successfully logging into my app. So in this way, you can install Ubuntu app and Sigwin app in your desktop for Unix command practice. Thanks for watching these videos. Uh, see you uh, in next video. I'll start some Unix command practice and uh, slowly, slowly I'll start uploading those videos into the channel. Thank you guys.